might yet be day. Can they get through to the final through this semi-final of the Emirates FA Cup? Well, it is the worst time to get knocked out of this competition. I know that from experience. So both sets of players desperate to get to that final. Well, Chelsea and Manchester United have been battling it out. To take the lead. He's in now. Well, they've broken through here with a really good goal. And the celebrations reflect that. The supporters are going crazy. It's a terrific moment for the team. Well, he got to the position of maximum opportunity. It was an impossible opportunity to squander. Yeah, we often say it was an easy chance, but you have got to be there. And uh, this lad has got the knack of doing that. here well they're in a good position here Lingard well he scored and it's a big moment for them in the match they pushed their lead now to two ahead they played well to this point but sometimes a two goal lead can be a dangerous one we'll see you have to be there to score it and he ran in and got his reward just couldn't miss no, it was a coach's effort the final finish wasn't difficult but to get there took a little bit of instinct This manager's been working hard on the training ground on a certain shape, and boy, is he getting results out there. Manchester United with the ball again. Rashford with the ball now. A real opening for him, and he's put it away. Nothing like for a manager seeing a goal like that. Real team effort. Great understanding between those lads down there. Well, that could be the game for Manchester United, should be the game. Well, you don't often see them oh let this God. kind of lead slip. Well, let's take another look at the goal. That, rushing it here, moving from one side to the other. It's Jesse Lingard trying to catch the other team out with a quick break here shredding it through Sanchez can finish it off full on the frame of the goal got to it somehow what a stop that was heading it's right into the corner it's and it's in it's perfect header he has his well that header flew in for a fine Whoa. goal oh it's fantastic timing he gets up early what an emphatic finish the goal then for Manchester United. Well, the defenders just stood rooted to the spot on the edge of the box, and what a poor one to concede. Well, let's take another look at the goal. He looked the goalkeeper in the eyes and said, right, I've got the win here, and he's got the goal to show that. I love that kind of finish when you don't have to blast it as long as the placement is right. his game isn't it intercepting change of direction infield and shoots beautiful goal well he's not far out but you've got to be on your toes 
in these circumstances, and he was. Well, this is when it's tough being a goalkeeper. A little bit more on it, and it would have been a very fine save. As it is, he's picking the ball out of the net. Yeah, he sets high standards, this lad, and I think he's just dropped below those. It's Lingard. Now Rash threads it through. Shoot Lingard. And Manchester United have made it count. They've scored. That was a top-class goal. Oh, that's a lovely poacher's goal. Johnny on the spot to tap it home. Another angle on it here. I know this manager's been working hard on the training ground on a certain shape, and boy, is he getting results out there. Well, it doesn't matter how you win a semi-final, it's just that you win, and they have this great result. Yeah, all about getting over the line. Nobody remembers losing semi-finalists, but they are the winners. It was absolutely... Extraordinary, exceptional, elegant, excellent. So often we think of his creative abilities, that knack of picking out a pass, but today it was all about his finishing. A really good couple of goals in this team win. And what about Eden Hazard here? Well, I don't think he'll be singled out by the manager for a poor performance. He's played well, he's scored a goal. He's...